Welcome everyone to this lo-fi Thor news video. What does that mean? That means usually I use my incredible superhero editing skills to make the best videos on YouTube. Today that's not going to happen because of time crunch and stuff. Uh, I want to make a video which is a one taker. So we're going to take a look at the sun because everybody's been saying, oh my god, solar activity is so low. Like the sun's almost dormant. It's just sitting there doing nothing. Remember, solar maximum and minimum is usually defined by sunspots and coronal mass ejections. Wait, solar flares. And that system is way too oversimplified. Hey, anyway, so let's get that going. Sweet. I'm going to make mistakes. That's the beauty of doing it live. A live taker. And we're looking at the sun. Over here we got the neutron star looking thing. Don't worry, it's not a neutron star. And then, um... These are what we've nicknamed the boob hills. Technically, Sage did it, so it's okay. Wow, look at that. Coronal mass ejection. That was in June on the 21st. And if you'll notice, the sun is the um, white circle in the middle, and they put the occulting disk over it so we can see the light coming out of the sun. We have occulting disk number two. We have occulting disk number three. And then right here is what we usually call the sun baby. All right now that you're cut off speed, we're checking out the sun and how it's doing virtually nothing. Wait, there's a bunch of light flying out of it, and we have seen, what the heck was that? Just flew past the screen. I think there's a couple of them in here. Yeah, they're, those are usually either like charged electrons, or magic spaceships, giant space birds. Whoa, look at that. The end of June. Now we have the sun with the double lightsaber. It doesn't have to be Darth Maul. Sure, there has to be some other Jedi out there who's a double-sided lightsaber. We know that the sun is not on the dark side. It's part of the light. But it's funny as I say that, we got a bunch of this dark matter stuff popping on the sun. Any giant black spot you see, you should have to ask why. Like, why is the sun having darkness? It's a great question. See, there was giant chunks of stuff on the 7th. Usually the beauty is I can slow it down. But this time I cannot. Now we're going to switch. I'm over at the Stereo Center, NASA. A lot of people don't like NASA, don't trust NASA, but uh, the Sun Kids in NASA have been really cool and gracious to me. And that most of the Sun data I can see, I verify with my own eyes. And so they seem pretty legit. But they do seem stuck under the cupboard at NASA. You know what I'm saying? And that's not their fault. We're all waiting for a great grand change, I believe. Alright, so this is the boring stuff. See, that's the stuff I usually cut out. All the boring parts, when I make mistakes, or I go like, oh, uh, eh, or crap like that. Anywho, you knew that. Let's go. So yeah, sun doesn't look that active, and the fact that this camera just gets weirder, weirds me out. But I ain't worried about that. I ain't worried about the sun. I ain't worried about nothing. Though the military has warned me that I should stay out of 37 cities tomorrow. Technically, that's not my plan. I'm half city, half country. Some people are like, you're dumb redneck. And I'm like, nope, not dumb. And uh, my hair's long, so my neck doesn't get red. Yeah, we're looking at the ninth. Looks like the sun's got some repiers. They're like thin swords. I don't know what that is, like pitchfork? But look at the sun baby at the bottom, man. Look at that sun baby right there. It's like the giant little circle thingy. Whoa, what was that? The sun's our friend. And definitely the most powerful thing I know of in the solar system that we can verify. And I think the sun shoots out material. So maybe the sun shoots out comets, and they're on fire. They're screaming dragons. It shoot all across the solar system. That'd be wicked. And also, if you're new to Thor news, I believe the sun's a dragon egg. Phoenix egg. Could be a scary thought. I know, but I love animals. Celestial, stellar, or otherwise. So that's cool. I ain't worried about nothing. 
Did I already mention that? I know, I'm a worry wart. Maybe that's not totally true. Now the sun has a triple-sided lightsaber. How do you even wield that? Or it looks like a man with a flat, square head that has his arms open wide saying, I love you, Earth. Why must you fight amongst each other and hate yourselves? Earth is so cool. Earth has everything you could ever dream of. Why can't you be happy there, Earthlings? Seriously, I'm like, I don't know, man. They keep bitching and complaining about it. But I think somebody's actively driving them crazy. And that makes me sad. All right, now we're going to learn. We're going to kick over here to Stereo HI1. We're going to have Mercury and Earth here. And then on the funny 1940s camera, we're going to have Mars and Saturn in front of the giant galactic center that looks like it's coming to eat us. Okay. But it's not, so don't worry. Boom, we're over here. Like this camera. Wait, what did I say that was? Mercury? Let's go back. You know, Earth and Mercury. Alright. So we got Earth and Mercury coming around the corner. We got interstellar medium lighting up when the sun lights up. We have the sun spewing constant plasma material at all times. It definitely looks busy. It doesn't look like it's a minimal situation. Whoa, what is that crazy crap? I don't know. Oh yeah, that's the galactic core passing on by. What is that? Is that a little planet? See that? Where's that guy? One more time. Come back, jerk ass. I didn't mean to call you a jerk ass. See, I found one thing. Now I just gotta wait. Well, oh, here it is. Look at it right there. By Mercury, it looks like a giant ball thingy. And there's another planet coming right there. There's that thing right there. See it? I'm sorry you're hearing my clicks. What the hell? Now I'm screwing up. Oh crap. No. Damn it. I'll get out of this. I'm sorry I shouldn't cuss. Doom. I'm not doom. Whoa, weird. Okay, so that. Fancy, fancy and fascinating. Now let's get to this camera. What the hell? Oh crap. Alright. Now we got the Galactic Milky Way Center. We have Saturn. We have Mars. We have the giant gremlin looking thing in the middle. It's like the scout ship. Tiny little Mars. Saturn looks big, man. Why does Saturn look bigger than Mars? Maybe I got him reversed. Did I get him reversed? How does Saturn look bigger than Mars? So this is Saturn. And that one's Mars. Saturn looks ginormous. Whatever the hell that is. Is that Nibiru? That was kind of jokey. Alright. This camera is the most 1940s, but it is also scariest at times. See, I don't, can't help that's Saturn. That would make more sense of Saturn. And those things are moving, and then that giant thingy, this giant big ball with dark on the light on the, the sun is there. Okay. Yeah, this camera is fun, huh? It's real fun. We're having fun with this camera now. Yeah, that thing behind Saturn and in front of Saturn looks really interesting. Okay. Now we got this one. You're not turning for me, man. You're screwing up my program. Both of you are in trouble. All right, wait a minute, 15 one second. Let's see if this one works. Boom. Okay, so... I guess we're going to have to wrap this one up. That one's not even finished loading. So yeah, there you go. Try one more thing. I don't know if you can stay with me this long. Solar system. Let's go. Okay, if this is the worst Thor news video ever, I'm sorry. We learned something today. We learned that the HI2 camera sometimes looks scary. What does it mean, actually? Uh, don't be scared. Everything's going to be all right. Although, they say in one hour and seven minutes, it's a day of rage. And it's like, I don't know of accomplishing anything good in a state of rage. Like, you know, even as a samurai, it's like, you know, you, you shouldn't rage. You know what I'm saying? Like, rage sounds bad. And the day of rage sounds like what they want you to do. And um, so maybe don't do what they want you to do. You know what I'm saying? Okay.
Yeah, it's Venus right there passing by the sun, I believe, and Venus's arms are giant. Venus has rings. Did you know that? Sun has rings. Um, good to know. So you learn stuff, I hope. Uh, Thor News should resume its scheduled programming. Asterisk. Kind of a feeling to do a Thor News Lo-Fi video day on Friday. Where it would be like five, six Lo-Fi videos. Uh, we'll see, though. I'm in a weird mood. These are strange times, and I think the energy is going to be really weird today. Tomorrow and through the summer. Possibly through the fall. And why is there like a giant twisty looking snake tendril sticking out of the sun that is that's interesting can you say this thing right here crazy it's all crazy well, anyway i'll definitely throw some amazing edited videos in between uh but for now if you're gonna stick with me stick with me if not lo-fi videos will have lo-fi in the title and if lo-fi is not your thing then you know, you don't have to watch the videos. So watch out if it's lo-fi and you don't like these. Then, But then if you didn't like them, why would you say this long? Okay, nothing makes sense. Nah, okay. I'm out of here. Peace out. God bless everyone. Did we learn anything? I hope. Something. Maybe. Ooh, this is what I want to see. Nah. Okay. We're looking for Nibiru. Or Herglubus. Or. Okay, if there's Saturn, there's Mars. And where's Eris? Okay, yeah, it was Saturn, Mars. Anyway, these are all fascinating tools. I guess this fascinating tool is not going to give me the... I guess that thing would be in Libra. Scorpius, Serpents type, whatever. All right, great. God bless everybody. Talk to you soon. Uh, thanks for sticking with me. Love you guys, but seriously, stay cool today. Channel your best self. Be your best. Be your best self. Don't let the bastards get you down. Stop being so damn angry, Earth. Okay. Peace out. No, that's okay for my mom. I said, it's like it hasn't ended yet. I'm like, I don't know why. All right. What are we doing here? Yeah, I definitely like editing better. Wait, I'm going to shut up. Crazy. Not that crazy. Oh, wow, it's almost like that. Those are not serious. Look at that. That's cool, man. It's like serious. Watch this. One cool thing and then I'm done. Interesting. I don't know what that means, if anything. Right, nothing. Okay. Yeah, that thing you would have been over there then. By Hodor. Hodor. We'll leave it on that. Hodor. 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 God bless everyone.